You're in the uh, the green points leaders jersey now after yesterday's time trial. Does your focus turn to trying to take that thing into Denver? Whew. All right, depends how hard the stages are. You know, if it's a full on uh, field sprint, it's a bit tougher for me these days. You know, I get a, a bit scared during those. But if it's a smaller group, you know, I still still think I'm fast enough for small groups. And if it's real hard at the end with some undulation in the roads, um, I'll definitely try to keep it. I know Denver's going to be a day that I'll try to get some points. And I mean, the main goal is to win the stage. And if we get get into the green, that'd be great. At this point in your career, I mean, you came into the season retired. You're back uh, in the pro peloton now. Six months ago, would you imagine that you were dicing it up looking for a stage win at, at this level of a race? No, that's it's so funny about it. I mean, I, I was, yeah, it was, six months ago, I was in a whole different world. And, uh, you know, I was enjoying riding my bike. I was helping out Team Specialized Development. Uh, and now it's a, you know, it's now at a higher level. And, you know, that's what I've, I was missing that. I, you know, once I got back into my riding my bike and, I, I was missing the high-level racing, and this is what I this is what I do good at. Good at. You know, this is where I this is where I uh, uh, excel is these long races like this. So this is the beginning. So I'm really really excited to finish this race off and concentrate on training well for for next year. I actually I only go for a stage win, and uh, all the rest is the bonus. Uh, what about that win in Denver? I mean, we're expecting to have a few hundred thousand fans down there in Denver. The energy at a at a stage finish like that. You've been at finishes like that at the tour. How much energy is that, and how much does it urge the sprinters on? Uh, actually, in the real bunch front, you uh, you don't hear it anymore. You only go for that goal, winning the stage. And uh, but of course, we have tomorrow also some laps, so you, we will see the fans all over there. So I think uh, it will be really great. How important is defending that jersey to Liquid Gas? Yeah, 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 the green jersey yeah, for me is a very important uh, objective in this uh, in this race uh, in the first stage i sprint uh, after in the last five kilometers after the the last claim uh, for for this uh, for this shirt and uh, other uh, now i have uh, another two possibility for the sprint and uh, i hope uh, for the, the green jersey yesterday's uh, sprint finish in steamboat kind of got some cobwebs dusted off what, how did how did that make you feel coming uh, coming into the first real bunch kick of the of the race really good i felt good you know i, I got about 500 meters ago I, I i i went to the front and i i hesitated you know it was one of those things i thought it was too early and that one second caused me to get back into the little box and then i was stuck i had nowhere to go and i i just basically run in it's as much that physical side as it is the mental side coming back and getting back into the top end sprinting like this, isn't it? It is. I mean, it's, it's, it is something that you, you get better the more you do it, you know. And yesterday was probably the first real bunch sprint I've done in a long time. And so, yeah, knowing where to, how to drift, how to get in the right position and, and not getting in those boxes where you can't get out of. And, uh, you, know, I've, uh, you know, I know how to do it and, uh, and, and time will make it better. How do you rate your competitors for the stage wins? You have Viviani and Aust from Liquid Gas. You have a couple of domestic experience, Robbie Forrester, who you've run against before. Yeah, and also uh, Freitje Rodriguez. So uh, we have some good uh, good sprinters, but uh, it makes it uh, more more difficult with uh, the high attitude here. So, uh, but uh, yeah, we will see what uh, what's happened. Van Hummel, uh, who, who's your top rival here as far as the the finales and the jersey? Yeah, Van Hummel uh, is a very, very sprint, uh, sprinter, a very good sprinter, but uh, today and uh, in the next day I have uh, a big team <laughs> and uh, I hope in my big team and I'm sure it's good, good uh, result in next, in next uh, stage. <laughs> Congratulations. Thank you, thank you very much.